cosine problems. There are three different types. The first one, we're given the angle, we're given the hypotenuse, so we can write out cosine. Cosine 41 degrees equals adjacent to our hypotenuse, x divided by 21.2 Put 1 under the cosine 41, cross multiply 21.2 times cosine 41, is equal to x, or x is equal to 21.2 cosine 41. Okay, we write this again with the value of cosine 41. is 0 0.7547. We multiply this out and we get 15.9996. Now to two decimal places, all these nines are going to round up, the six will round up, and we get 16.00 centimeters. A second problem, we're given the angle and we're given the adjacent side, 14.5, and we're required to work out the hypotenuse x. Cosine 35 degrees equals adjacent of hypotenuse 14.5 divided by x a 1 under the cosine 35 and cross multiply as before x times cosine 35 degrees is equal to 14.5 ok we need x on its own so we divide both sides by cosine 35 degrees the cosine 35 degrees cancels on the left and we're left with it underneath the 14.5. So x is equal to 14.5 divided by cosine 35 degrees. If we put in those numbers, x is equal to 14.5 divided by zero point eight one nine two. And this comes to 17.7001, which easily rounds to two decimal places to 17.70 centimeters. In our third problem, we're required to work out theta. We're given the hypotenuse and we're given the adjacent side. So we put Cosine theta is equal to 19.9 divided by 27.2. This works out to be 0 0.7316. Now to work this out we use the shift or the inverse key on the calculator with the cosine minus 1 button and we get our value for theta. Theta is equal to 42.9793. The 3 rounds down, the 9 rounds up, so we make that 7 to 8, so we get 